Well, over the weekend, the Falconer wrestling team brought home yet another state championship win with a 40-39 to victory in Syracuse on Saturday. WNY News Now's Craig McFadden is here with more on this big triumph. Craig? Hi, Justin. Yes, battling Mount Sinai in the championship round, the Falconer men's wrestling team was down five points before Falconer's Braden Newman took to the mat to secure the victory. Newman spoke with reporters about the hard work that went into winning the title. We've been here three times now. We've came up short twice. We've grinded all summer for this, all winter, and this is just huge. All the work I think our coach put into this, it's unbelievable. That coach, Drew Wilcox, has a history of winning big. While he was unsure if the team could pull it off late in the match, he says there couldn't have been a better ending. This is storybook. This is perfect. Um, I'll be honest, I thought we were cooked going to 95. Mount Sinai's 95 is unbelievably good. Uh, our guy, Brock Johnson, you saw the four-foot high bridge to fight off his back. Um, the kid's a gamer. The kid is, is extremely tough, and he gave it everything he had. And you know, Him fighting off his back there was, was one of the main reasons we won that duel. Wilcox credits the team's spirit to the overwhelming amount of support from parents and the community in general. Live in the newsroom, Craig McFadden, WNY News Now. All right, Craig, thank you. The team was welcomed home late Saturday night by first responders there in Falconer before players headed home for some much-needed R&R. &R.